Hi, in this video we'll demonstrate how to install a swing gate. Here are the tools required to install it with. Unwrap your swing gate. Identify the lock side from inside looking outwards. Measure the width of your opening in three places. Measure your opening's height in three places. Measure any protrusions. You need a minimum of 50mm of clear space after any protrusions. Put your swing gate inside the opening. While holding up the swing gate, line up the top hinge with the bolt of the gate and mark off the bottom of the hinge. Ensure that the hinge is leveled and clears any protrusions. Mark off the holes. Drill 12mm holes at the marked off points. Insert your wall plugs into the holes. Align the top hinge with the poles and insert your snap off security bolts. Use a spanner with a 17mm socket to fasten the bolts. Ensure that you do not fasten the bolts too tightly or snap off the tops. Place your swing gate inside the opening and insert the top bullet into the fastened hinge. Ensure that the gate is leveled. Place your bottom hinge onto the wall and insert the gate's lower bullet into the hinge then mark off the holes. Draw 12mm holes at the mark of points and insert your wall plugs. Align the hinge with the holes and insert your snap off security bolts. Use an extended 17mm socket spanner to fasten the bolts. Not too tightly and don't snap off the tops. Now we'll demonstrate how to change the lock tongue. Unscrew the lock screw located on the side. Insert the cylinder with the key inside and turn it anti-clockwise so that the cylinder fits into the lock. Now turn the key anti-clockwise until the lock tongue is ejected. Twist the lock tongue into the required position and push it back in. Turn the key clockwise to bring the lock tongue back in. Fasten the screw back into the side of the lock closest to the lock tongue. Insert your lock into the lock bar. Insert your key into the cylinder and twist the key so that the cam doesn't protrude from the side then insert the cylinder into the lock. Fasten the lock screw into the lock. Align the cover plate and drill the 5mm hole through the top hole into the swing gate. Fasten the lock into the swing gate with a pop rivet. Do the same for the bottom hole. Align the lock box with the swing gate's lock and level it out. Mark off the holes of the lock box. Drill 8mm holes at the marked off point. Insert your 8mm wall plugs. Fasten your lock box to the wall. Insert the plugs of the lock box. To close any gaps between the swing gate and the lock box, use the hinge space as provided. To fit your rows, you'll need a 3.2mm steel drill bit and a 3.2x8mm pop rivet. Place your plastic rows around the locking cylinder. Drill 3.2mm holes at the top and bottom using the rows as a guide. 
fasten your rose to the gate with the pop rivet. You may then snap off your security bolt. Congratulations, you have now fully installed your swing gate. Burglar Ball Warehouse, serious security at your doorstep.